these are the things men must do for women you should always slow down in bed men we don't understand that these women they don't want to be seen as sex objects however apart from that some of these women they also want to enjoy sex they want to have fun you will learn how you can make her get an orgasm how to make her feel good about the sex thing but the faster you do things because it's what you want you're always having the sex thing and you don't want to learn your woman it becomes so hard for you to understand your lady your lady will tell you that the first time i had an orgasm is when i was that five years old You've been with that lady in a relationship for more than 20 years and she has never really enjoyed sex. Slow down, understand the lady, let her also enjoy the pleasure, but she will also feel happy and she will enjoy that and she won't really even think about leaving or cheating on you because at the end of the day, you are satisfying her sexually. The second thing is, there is a verse that every man should always memorize. I will be late. I should call. When you go somewhere and you want to have fun with your boys and maybe you end up being late, we assume that the women know what's going on. They know what's happening in our life. No, they don't know. That will make a lady know that you also care about her. Most of these women, they think differently because you are late, maybe you are with another lady. So you owe her that. You are late because maybe you are still in the office, the traffic jam, you are late because of certain things in your life and you don't want really to go home and start arguing with your lady. She's already not happy because you never communicated to her or you wait until she calls you to know why you are late no it will be much fair if when you are late you should call her and if you can't manage to call her text her that i will be late because i am on a traffic jam i will be late because i will still be in the office some of the women they are dramatic they want more explanation it is easy for you to explain buy your lady a tampon without feeling emasculated Okay, she's your lady, she's going to be your wife. It feels good eh, to give her just $10, tell her to go and buy the, always the pads. That is just a basic need. That is something that everyone should do for their lady, for their women. If you truly care, women, they have their own money. They can buy the, what they want. Be a responsible man enough and know that when they are on their periods, you need to make sure that she has pads. She needs to have an extra one. If don't quote me wrongly. I'm just trying to say that if you are in a serious relationship with that lady, you want to marry her, start to be a responsible man and do the basics. Some of you will come for me for that. This only happens to good women and you know that they deserve it. When you ask as many questions as you want from your lady and then you end up answering them, there will come a time whereby you also need to ask those questions to the lady and you will need them to answer you the exact answer. That way, when someone maybe is having a relationship with another guy, it will be easy for you to tell. When something is not right in the relationship, it will be easy for you to tell. People should summarize some of the things. If this is how I always text you, maybe that is how it's supposed to be done. If they change suddenly, they reduce or they don't tell you the exact words. Sometimes because they are starting a relationship with other people, maybe they are cheating on you emotionally. It's just a trick I'm trying to tell men. can also be just something like a password when they try to call you you ask them the same questions they give you the different answer you know something is wrong with them i need people to comment down below you've been in your colleges you've been in your universities and you want to take your relationship to a next level before maybe marrying, you need to make sure that the beddings that you are having when you are in universities you need to dispose them i mean don't take me wrongly but you know most people who are in colleges who are in universities they go through a lot of drama, they go through a lot of different things in their life and when it comes to the beddings, huh? especially the beddings, there are a lot of things that go on. Make sure that you get rid of that red towel, blue mattress, buy new ones, start a new chapter with the lady when you have at least a different life. When you have the same mattress that you are chewing with your exes and with your maybe the best friends, the best mate, this is someone that I always trust. How do you want to connect with the lady when you are using the same beddings that you are using when you are in your college? Grow up, make sure that you change your beddings, get rid of them, give them up, and try to adjust 
they need respect from you and if you truly care and love them have a better bed a better mattress you should do whatever it takes to make up if you are just a jerk i want you guys to understand me in the better way and get the point that i'm trying to give you and most of the time women are the one who have the emotions who have the feelings sometimes they don't want to listen but instead of admitting to that and maybe seeking an apology from your lady you want to be little the lady however i know that's something that most women do instead of solving a problem they try to be little them here but sometimes women they have emotions they have feelings and they need to know that a man feels bad because he made a, a certain mistake they want to understand that this is someone who understands and also have feelings for the lady you truly know that you made a huge mistake you can tell you made a mistake you, you are supposed to do whatever it takes to make sure that you make up with the lady even stand in the rain with the radio do whatever it takes to apologize and make up with the lady and you know that it's not fair it's something you cannot do to other human being it just feels from your heart that you are wrong you are jack you can always tell when you are wrong i don't do it because women are belittling you always complaining always trying on the wrong sides and it's a gift from a man if you bring her a gift and doesn't fit women they have illusions they think differently women are just different that's just how they think that gift it will bring a lot of drama in the relationship how will complain i might be dramatic just look at the price of the shoes if you like them and you want a lady to have them then give the lady money let her go get the shoes that will solve a lot of problems don't come for me this is the last one and i want us to know if all men we are doing with this don't surprise a lady with maybe you cooked for her pasta with a lot of spices you've used a lot of sufurias when she always cooks that spaghetti she only uses two sufurias Today you decided you want to, to surprise her with a good meal and you decide to cook for her and instead of using two sufurias you used eight sufurias I want you to get my point make sure if it was a surprise you want to make her happy make sure you wash the utensils it's different from surprising a lady because you want to make her happy and you want to cook a meal for her you use three sufurias and maybe after eating she will wash the utensils I will have cooked I will have used two sufurias or three sufurias. Women will think that it was a punishment. Oh gosh, he wanted to punch me. Don't even do it. If you will use a lot of utensils after cooking, wash them or don't cook for her. And am I being so harsh? Is it something that is genuine? I want to know in the comment section down there. And this is the Green Elima. Until next time, be safe, take care and let's have peace.